Yo, what is going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. And today we need to have a very serious video. A Fortnite player, Fortnite coach, has tested positive for the coronavirus. Now, we all know the coronavirus is nothing to play around with. We saw what happened to Rudy Gobert. Rudy Gobert tried to make everyone feel better about it and then just got it himself. Um, so yeah, it is nothing to play around with. And now Fortnite pros who were in contact with our good friend, Desmond Jesus, are saying that they are sick and have coronavirus symptoms. Now, I want to make it clear, this is not Destiny Jesus' fault for getting the coronavirus. This is technically nobody's fault for getting the coronavirus. Um, but it needs to be addressed. So pretty much two and a half weeks ago, Anaheim Dream Hack happened. Maybe almost three weeks ago by now. Anaheim Dream Hack happened. And Destiny Jesus was coaching a lot of players like Zach, uh, TSM Zekro, TSM Macwood, and Bruce Pitt. Most of the players are on TSM. I want to make that clear. So then what happens is awesome so then after the tournament destiny destiny decides to go on a holiday which is perfectly fine a vacation you know being a fortnite coach is very stressful especially after a tournament like that and you go to places like hollywood venice which is honestly not that good of a place to be going to but again he didn't really know anything back then because it wasn't that big hit in italy and then fast forward about another two weeks to where we are about five days ago of when this video is getting uploaded, Italy goes on lockdown. The entire Italy is on quarantine because the corona coronavirus has hit so hard in Italy that it is literally on lockdown. And Venice is in Italy. As far as I know, Venice is in Italy. Might be getting some stuff messed up, but I'm pretty sure Venice is in Italy. So then, so Italy's on lockdown, the entire United States is literally freaking out. You go on news that cover the world, every single news the entire time is coronavirus. I think people just underestimated it, and now they think okay, it's not that scary. Fast forward to today, and Destiny Jesus tweets out, Tested positive for coronavirus. And then, uh, pros like Zach, Zach Zero, TSM Zach Zero, TSM Mapwood, and TSM uh, Reverse 2K all started, are all start, and TSM Creo all started saying on Twitter they are sick and have coronavirus symptoms. This is not good, guys. If they have coronavirus, if they have coronavirus symptoms, they could have had got it from anybody at DreamHack. DreamHack is massive. They could have been for anybody. Now, luckily, uh, Destiny Jesus did make a video, and he did state that he does believe that he did not catch it at Anaheim DreamHack, which is good because he believes if he did test it, get it at An Anaheim DreamHack, more Fortnite players would have already tested for it. And most likely would have tested positive if he already got it. As you, as you know. But this is scary because now if Fortnite pros are testing, Fortnite pros collab all the time. Like, you know, my Fortnite pros like go to each other's places, like Phase and TSM, like all that stuff. Fortnite pros together is not something uncommon. Now, what's really frightening is that Fortnite FNCS is coming up. And if these players are, have symptoms of coronavirus, they're not gonna be able to compete. So some of our best players like Zextro will not be able to most likely compete if they have coronavirus symptoms. Now, if the if Fortnite is to if Epic Games is to announce the Fortnite World Cup, they need to keep in mind about the coronavirus, which I think it might be another reason why Epic has not decided to announce it is because of the coronavirus. 
Now, why am I saying that? Because, A, they pro I think they were going to announce it, but then saw what's going on with the coronavirus, and I'm deciding not to announce it. I mean, keep saying it. Also, we've seen how a toll this is taking on the entire world. This is an entire world pandemic. The United States is in a national emergency because of this. Um, schools in Illinois, uh, Wisconsin, Oregon, I believe, all shut down their schools. L.A. County, the biggest, like, probably top three biggest school districts in the world, shut down their schools. I know at first, because I go to school, our school recently made us fill out a survey if we have internet at our house. That's how bad this is getting. Also, also, sports leagues like the NBA, NHL, Major League Soccer, uh, I believe every European league, um, every Chinese basketball league, which has been shut down for a while, but every, the PGA Golf Tour, all are canceled and have no set time to return. Those are pro leagues. Even leagues like Formula One, NASCAR, and IndyCar have shut down. Those are motorsports cars. They do not drive inside a arena. They drive outside. This is how bad I got. When I first heard about it, I thought, oh, they're just going to shut down most likely. Like, they're just going to shut down places that have indoor sports. But no, they shut down pretty much everything. And then the NCAA cancels March Madness, which... In case you didn't know, if you somehow don't know, March Madness is one of the biggest things in basketball. So, yeah. That's pretty big of a show now, though. And then, I believe that's about it. The only two things that I know about the, in the, in the um, USA that have not shut down are, um, WWE, which are held, held in their, you know, holding their events with no fans, and the USC, which is also holding their events with no fans. Now, this is really interesting because of the fact that this is really interesting due to the fact that if a uh, sports thing needs to take that big of precautions, then an uh, esports team needs to take those precautions. So, pretty much. Uh, death, I think it's, I'm pretty sure it's, um, Reverse 2K said that his symptoms are getting better, but still are not that good. Um, now, personally, I've been sick for a while, I've had a cough, and I've been trying to get, I am thinking about asking my parents to try to get me tested for the coronavirus, but I have not completely decided yet. <laughs> so, the long story is sure. Or is Destiny Jesus has tested positive for the coronavirus. He was in contact with some Fortnite pros, and the Fortnite pros say that Destiny Jesus and that they're saying now they're sick. They have symptoms like a cough. Now a cough, I believe, is the worst of worst something you can get. Um, but also, you gotta realize if you have asthma issues, that could be another thing. It is very hard to tell if you have a flu, common cold, or coronavirus at the moment. But also, another scary thing is that the elderly are also in really bad danger. The odds that you get it and you're a kid are a lot lower than you get it if you're 65 and above. If you're above 80, your odds are like 90 and above to get it. Over a kid that's like 4, you get like 2% chance of getting it. Most people have like a 2% chance of getting it. I do want to make it very clear. It is not like if you live right now, you are automatically going to get the coronavirus, guys. But we do not need to be joking around like Rudy Gobert did. We all know how he did that. He pretty much single-handedly shut down the NBA. And, and this world has just gotten more scary and scary. But yeah, any discussion, Destiny Jesus does have the coronavirus. This will be very interesting to see if any other Fortnite pros get tested besides the people that are going on Twitter saying that do. That's mainly just the TSM team. There's this one pick with, like, uh, Destiny, TSM, Zexero, TSM, Verse 2K, TSM, Macklin. That has all of them in the same picture. 
and they're all saying they have symptoms and there's a couple more I think Creo might be in the picture but Creo is definitely saying he has symptoms Creo is definitely saying that he has symptoms so yeah thank you guys for watching please subscribe like comment share make sure you guys stay safe and until next time I will see you guys in the next video